Well, good morning. Welcome. Good morning. Hi. Hi. Um, I was just calling. I remembered back you had talked one day about whether the world could continue on or not to change subjects. But actually, that same day you talked to John LeBouvier mm-hmm. about um, contacting a spiritualist. Oh, yeah. And in the Bible, it says in Deuteronomy, I'm putting it in my own words, I'm showing that. It says, um, let no man who practices uh, sorcery, witchcraft, cast spells, or consult the dead. Anyone who does these things is detestable in the Lord's eyes. Mm -hmm. And I'll tell you, Mm -hmm. I'm 63. Mm -hmm. I went to a medium when I was 21. And that was the worst mistake I made in my entire life. Why? What happened? Um, it... It did sway my decisions on certain things. Like what? Um, it was just things that she told you about your future or this or that. And, um... What did she say to you that really threw you off? Oh, my God. I mean, she had my family down pat, my parents. She brought my emotions out. Like, yeah. I, I just am not a very emotional person like that. Yeah. But uh, now she ended up saying I was going to meet a guy and yada yada, different things like that. I ended up marrying him. I'm telling you, that guy walked in, and it was the perfect example. Was she him. right? Was she right in her predictions? Uh, yes, we ended well, up getting married. Some people are born with special gifts, so yeah. Yeah, but also um, those mediums and... Um, that's the word I want. Um, the spiritualist, they consult the evil side. No, no, they don't. No. no, the ones I know Not certainly it. don't. In fact, just the opposite. If anything can be said, just the opposite. All the mediums and uh, people who are involved in that uh, kind of spiritual beliefs are very positive, loving, very nice people. So on this one, you and I are going to just uh, say thank you, all right? And have a great weekend.